Democrats love talking about equity, but turns out socialist Bernie Sanders isn't even sure what it means. <laughs> How would you differentiate between equity and equality? Well, equality, we talk about, uh, I don't know what the answer to that is. <laughs> Come to think of it, you know, uh, equality is equality of opportunity. Is... Equity, I think, is more guarantee of outcome, is it not? I yeah, think... I think so. I think that's Okay. Fine. So which, do you come, which side do you come down on? Uh, we... Equality. Well, wow. What a deep thinker, Dana. Yeah. You could tell this was the first Unmasked. time you'd ever thought about this. <laughs> right. And also, do you, like, so I remember distinctly Greg making that distinction just years ago when all of this started. And that's what helped me make sure I always knew the um, difference. Now, I've put on the spot what I have to think about it for a second, maybe, because equity has become this word that you hear all the time. In fact, it's so ingrained in our society that even Joe Biden, the president, has issued an executive order making sure that there would be equity across the entire government. Are those... And now that people are pushing back on that, they don't want it necessarily, and it turns out, guess what? Bernie Sanders doesn't want it either. That's when Joe was just first coming into office and they handed him a bunch of papers yeah. and he, he was just signing things. He had no idea what he was <laughs> signing. Yeah, you know, it's like a couple of weeks ago, because uh, the, the confusion is intentional. They yes. want to, I, I think yeah. I said something, yeah. I don't remember, that we, we, they want to replace the word equality with equity. But equality, everybody has the opportunity from below to excel. So the starting blocks are the same. Yeah. Equity requires that everyone finish the same, you know, which means right. there has to be force from above to keep everybody down, which is absolute fascism. So it, it's, it's a, it's a, it, it, this isn't a subtle distinction. It's like the most important distinction yeah. in yeah. the world. The only way to unite people is equality. The only way to divide people, equity. equity. Mm -hmm. That is why you see equity being favored by people in power, mm -hmm. because it keeps us divided. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Judge Janine. You know, I don't know whether to congratulate him or pity him. Congratulate him because, you know, he came around or pity him because he either doesn't remember or he's a liar. So that's all I have to say. I don't think that that's scary. That whole thing was scary. Everybody knows the difference between equality and equity. Everybody. I don't think so. I don't think so either. I think, I think actually, I well, how could he not know? Well, he should. Well, he doesn't think about defining it. He has a new book where it definitely talks about these issues, but equality has basically been wiped out of the discussion, right? Mm -hmm. Everything is about equity because it involves extra resources going to people who have different circumstances. By if you've suffered by. By force. And also by the kindness of people's hearts to no, make sure we get to a place no, that we're equal. Only equity I will can be say, done by force. Not so I'm not a huge Bernie Sanders fan because of what happened in the 2016 primary. He should have dropped out earlier. But I thought he was very charming in his Bill Maher interview. No, and natural. he was very... Real person. So calm. A, a real person. And true to himself. And No, that's why he's watching. popular. That's why even right. people yeah. like him. And why young popular. people love this 81-year-old. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'd never heard a politician say, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. no. It was really <laughs> and he could have seen rolled yeah. through. One of yeah. these days, a TV commentator will say Not that. at this table. Not at this table. <laughs> okay. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.